the Crazy Town Podcast. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Dynamite, the explosive one. Let's crack into another one. TNT. Hey. Um, I know this is probably going to be old news, too. It's old news week because I'm going on vacation. It is um, old news week. So, like, Reddit's melting down. Yep. <sighs> Looks like it, man. Which is very sad for me. Yeah, I mean, not really. It's sad for me. I mean, not really. Why is it not sad? Because this red is not really going anywhere, and not yet, at least. It's going to be sad. I think, like, I think <laughs> you're right. It is going to be sad. <laughs> like, like, like you're, you're Reddit is right now in the hospital with like a minor cough. All right, it's like, oh, I'll be fine. L- little do we realize that the cough is being caused by a malignant tumor that's going to end up being cancerous. That's going to make it terminal. So, like, you're feeling sad because I'm having trouble breathing. Yeah, 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 yeah exactly. Yeah. You're sad because Reddit is sick right now. Reddit is sick. I think Reddit's going to get better, but then it's going to get terminal, and then it's probably going to die. Yeah, I mean, and what do we mean by that, Jonas? What so do we mean? Because so the current think, situation is yeah, and this could be be different by now. So explain, and I, I mean, I'm not even going to go into like the whole rigmarole. No, no, about, explain, people don't know. Explain, it's fine. It's a people podcast. Do we, know? Okay, no, no, they don't. So literally, okay, so Reddit is going public, so they're going to be issuing stock. They're going to become a publicly traded company, and so basically, what's happening is there's a bunch of coders developers people who that have made apps that use the data aggregation system of reddit at no charge to to create alternate versions you can look at reddit on so it's, it's very funny actually uh if you go to like uh your instagram app youtube a lot a lot of these have what they call apis too and yeah and that's how, and that's like their date their raw data feed that you can then create a program that pulls the data from that feed and you can put great basically create a shell that looks however you want. And I personally use a Reddit app that is a third party app. Very clean, very like basic. Like I don't like all the frills and pictures and like all that stuff. And uh, ads. At, I mean, yeah, there's still ads, but it's for the app. Barely. Yeah. yeah. Well, what Reddit is doing is since they're going public, obviously they owe duty to the shareholders to make money. So they're block, they're charging, they're going to start charging an absorbent amount. Of money to access this API, so basically all these like sync like individual dudes. Reddit is fun. Apollo app of a host Bacon of other apps. Reader or something. Yeah, yeah, a host of other apps are not going to be able to. Yeah, they're going to all have to shut down because so like the community was like, "Hey, this is unfair." And I guess like a lot, all the moderators. If you don't know what Reddit is, Reddit is basically oh, a, it's, it's basically <laughs> a ca- a, a categorized back. forums. And they have volunteer moderators who make zero dollars to to keep the content relevant to the to the to the forum, keep porn out, keep spam out, regulate comments, mm-hmm. like basically keep it from being a cesspool of the internet, Just, like 4chan. Justice for the Jannies, I'm I'm with you. Right. So so people are like, hey, a lot of our tools we use as moderators are also using your API third party. You're gonna take those tools away from us. Yep. We're doing this for free. And Reddit was based the, the and the uh, CEO of Reddit basically was like go pound salt. He did it. He did a ask an AMA and ask me anything, which is a popular Reddit thing where somebody like the, the community asks questions and they answer. Yo, you have to explain every ounce if, of hot dog, bro. <laughs> but feel and, free, feel free. And continue. he did that continue. and made things like ten times worse because he like just double and tripled down on all of his comments. Yeah. And look, like, and my my whole argument with it is that, yes, they are taking away these third-party apps. So the app product producers, I guess, the people who made the apps are going to be losing out on any money that they were getting from it. I don't it. think they're making a lot of money. If they have ads on them, they're probably making a little bit. It right? probably covers their cost to make the app. Yeah, maybe, bro. I don't know. Well, right. Either way. Either way. So... All they're really doing is saying is that now you're going to have to use our app, our Reddit app. Which is trash. Which is trash, but it's functional. I mean, it's it's not broken. It's not broken. It's functional. People use it. And because a bunch of... (laughs) Look, I'm not trying to say is that Reddit is in the right, but they are in the right. Oh, all right. Yeah. Essentially, all they're taking away is a skin. So they're taking away some tools that the, that the well, uh, moderators use. Yes, but are the moderators still going to be able to do what they do? Yes. But what I think is funny, but, 
What's ironic. That? Yeah. Is that basically all the moderators are are a hundred percent free labor for Reddit? We we call it free labor, but it's you got to look at what a what a moderator is. A moderator is usually a person that starts up a subreddit because of why? Because it's a passion project for them. Yeah, and which I agree to. If you have a passion for something, and then you start posting stuff, and other people with similar passion come in and start sharing their passion for something that you have, that's a beautiful thing. That's what makes Reddit a beautiful place. Is that I can be like, I really like uh, the phone cords from the from the nineteen eighties that are curly. That yeah, yeah. And then you just start posting pictures of phones, and then people are like, Oh, I used to have this phone, and they start commenting. And then you have conversations. It's a beautiful reddit is a beautiful place for very hyper uh hyper specific niches and then finding people who can even assist you yeah with like, and even you know broad topics such phone. as pics or videos or it's, financial financial advice yeah, or like and then whatever you start getting into more generalized stuff like that obviously news is a big part portion of it and i will have to say is that some of the some of the moderators from some of the more like popular sites some of the more credible ones and not some of the more niche probably do deserve some sort of payment and i hope there's a model for that later on i'm not a hundred percent against like these people who who look after these large subreddits with like hundreds of thousands and constantly like going through comments millions of millions of users a day yeah, and constantly like scrolling through comments to keep like the racist and the misogynist and just like the hateful slander Spam that can, and yeah, yeah and keeping that out of the comments that is a big job and they do deserve some compensation for that but on the same note, man, it, it it is their company. And like, if you don't like the fact that they've taken some of your tools away or the essentially what I, I equate to a skin of what Reddit is, because it's like the Reddit app is no different from the Reddit is fun app. It's just that it works worse, but right. it, it does the same thing. You, right. you can get the same information. It just may take you a little bit longer to get there. So I, or you have to sort through a bunch more BS to get there, whatever. Yeah, my big thing is that, like I say, it's going public. So a lot of the copyrighted information or copyrighted materials going bye bye. And that means like memes with like a movie. Sorry, copyrighted. Can't have that. Take it down. Uh, a lot of the NSFW. You, you can't take my Reddit porn from me. All right. Don't do that to me. I need. It's I all need. Even. I They're need, going the way of Tumblr, bro. No, I need to know what Angel Rat 2020 is doing right now. I need to know what she's up to. Angel Rat. I don't know. It sounds like a. Like, it sounds else? like one. You're right. I need to know. But so essentially, so what? Then what they're doing is like you know the CE standing his ground. So then the the moderators were like protesting and then they basically just use their power to just like strip them of the moderator status and just put other people in. so they're like if you won't follow the rules somebody else will buy and i mean like, and they're not wrong right they're not well, wrong but here's the thing i guess here's the thing that i it's like it's gonna come to a head mm -hmm. and what happens if 50 percent of the moderators just say f it i'm done i mean it seems like a lot of moderators have said that and with the recent protest uh going from like the john oliver protest to the everything is nsfw protest to whatever protest is going on right now that we don't know about because this video is done two weeks in advance i don't know but i i, I do know is that they were actually banning moderators who participated in some of the protesting, yes. which I think is a little nuts. You you can't <laughs> you can't do that. That's kind of screwed up. Just to, banning them from the that's site. Nuts. They've they've done nothing but work to help generate people coming to your site, and you're like, eh, eh, sorry, you're banned. Yeah, that. that's a little crazy. And I guess, and Dig was a little before my time, mm -hmm. but Dig was a big site like Reddit before they were, Reddit. They were, and they Precursor tried to too. pull some similar shit. They did, and they basically imploded on themselves, and they everyone did. quit and went to Reddit. So they did, and now people are looking for the next thing. And apparently, uh, Big Zuck, Big Zuck, he's uh been talking about building an ancillary to Twitter that may. Uh, I, I ain't using Big Zuck's Reddit. I'm not using Big Elon's twit. Yeah, man. I just I know Big Zuck's Rex sounds freak Reddit sounds crazy. Yeah, it would just be <gasps> this 
Facebook again. It is literally just Facebook again. But so you, if it if it does the same function, like I really don't care the name that's on the IP that uh that gives me the well, information. Well, the thing about Reddit I love is it's but, basically anonymous. Yeah, I mean, but it, there's nothing to say that the next big thing can't have that same it's anonymity. Sucky putting anything anonymous out there. I mean, I understand the whole. The fart. second you got a you got a KYC your Reddit account, everybody's gone. We'll see, and and then I would not take it because then it is just Facebook. So, like I say, if something can do similar things with the anonymity, the uh, streamlined information. And the ability to like just have fun in the comments, man. Then yeah, I'm game for it. I'm game for it. Twitter is the closest thing that I can tell you of, but and Twitter's not, not really set up it's like nothing Reddit. like Reddit. Yeah, though. It's, I mean, but kind of. No. <laughs> Except it's not and there's no anonymous. Well, there can be anonymous. no. There's no like it's not. It's not aggregated, right? It's just like a mess. You can search hashtags, I mean, but true. like it's not like you that's don't go true. to the subreddit for Angel Face Twenty or Angel Rat. What do you say, Angel? <laughs> Angel, rat. Angel Rat's subreddit. You have to go to Twitter and try to hashtag Angel Rat, yeah. and hopefully you find. It, but you just find everybody's. It's like finding the comments without the Reddit post yeah. first, and then it's like, and then reverse engineer, reverse engineering it. So I don't know, man. It makes me sad because that's where I get like all of my news. I mean, just don't don't be sad yet because the sadness is really coming when it does die. Yeah, well, like well, the quality, the quality of the the front page right now is looking. By the time iffy. this video comes out, my app will have quit working. Ooh, that's facts. So, I don't even know if I'll still be using it. Oh man, I don't know, man. There's so much good information, and we're gonna yeah. No, here's the next video. So I download the Reddit app, TNT. Yeah, <laughs> I'm getting ready to download it tonight. <laughs> I am. I'm moving on, dude. I'm I'm good. I'm fine Aww. with it. It's a skin. I don't care. All right. Well, that's all the time we have for this episode. Go to thecrazytown.com for Jonas. TNT. Oh, uh, we out.